Hey, how's it going guys? <clears throat> so right now I am at my grandparents' house uh, working on my younger brother's uh, Mazda Tribute. It's an 05 um, and his alternator went out. So I get to fuck with this for a while. Um, his alternator went out uh, and he drove like an hour on the battery light. So the alternator shot, we got a new battery, it's still fucked. Um, but, in a minute here, I'm gonna switch the camera. Uh, there's no fucking way to get this alternator out. It literally, on the bottom, is the subframe. Um, to the right of it is the axle, and then from the top is the head, because it's a V6. So, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might have to pull a head off and I really don't want to. Um, I'm gonna see what I can do to not do that. Uh, probably hit some YouTube and figure it out. But uh, yeah, I just wanna give you a little update. Um, I might only be going at this for a couple hours today. And then I'm gonna go over by Hunter's house and we're gonna put the engine in the hatch unless he's done that already. But I'm still going over there. So, yeah. Yeah, let me switch the camera. I'll show All you right, guys. So, here we are. The alternator's right here. His axle seal is just shot. Um, I had to take this little fucking cover off, and you can't get that out. So, I know that the alternator's not coming out <laughs> that easy. But, uh, here we, there we go. Yeah, so, there's the alternator. And it's super fucking close to everything. Like like I was saying, you know, the subframe's right here. Um, the tie rod's right there. And then this side is the axle. And there's the alternator again. There's the axle. And then the crank pulley's right here. And so, you know, I might be able to get away with taking the exhaust off. But otherwise, you know, the second head is back here. So, oh, and the intake manifold. So, I really, really don't want to have to take that off, but, you know, uh, like I said, I'll hit some YouTube and figure out what I have to do to not do that. Yeah, uh, 
Um, oh, you guys can't see shit. But, uh, yeah, I didn't mess around with my idol. And, uh, my tune for my idol and everything. But, otherwise, this fucker's not bad, man. Definitely not too shabby. But, uh, yeah. Oh, can't see anything. Yeah, um, I don't know. I just had to call it quits with my brother's car because I'm not going to drop a subframe down uh, if I don't have to, and I really don't want have to because um, we can take it to a shop. I just wanted to see if I could do it, and I can't. I could, but I'm not, I'm not going to be the one that's liable for uh, fucking it up, so... Yeah, I think that's uh, it for today, maybe. I don't know. Peace out. Catch you guys later. How's it going, guys? So, it's a couple hours later, and uh, I was watching the Honda vlogs um, and the Honda recap show. And I've been trying to put out more videos and trying to get on there. Um, so... I was very surprised when uh, Christian from Honda Vlogs, uh, you know, went and was talking about Hunter's channel and then uh, brought Michael and I up. So it was pretty cool. Um, you know, I'm still trying to push more videos out and everything, but here is that clip. Hunter tuned. This guy has moved from cars to motorcycles and I cannot be happier because this guy is rocking a Hayabusa on the drag strip. In the latest video, he hung out with everybody. He got Michael. Michael's getting some slicks. Christian's getting his car ready for the drag strip as well. And we got Hunter messing with Hayabusas. I, I don't know, man. I'm starting to get worried because I know you love horsepower and speed and a Hayabusa is just dangerous, bro. I'm just telling you right now, I fear for you. Alrighty guys, that's pretty cool, I thought at least. Um, but thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned. Uh, what else? What else do we normally do? You know, stay tuned, fucking keep her moving. Fucking hey, how you doing, stinky porn? <laughs>